this year we have migration as the team of the carnival. You agree with me that the issues of migration is still very much with us. In the last two years, we played up uh, climate change as the team for uh, the carnival. Um, you are aware that global warming is real. This year again, we decided through the excellent review of His Excellency, he brought that out of his Pandora box to say that um, where are we on those things that make humans move and as it affects development. It is out of this that the bands are now asked to interpret this on the 12 kilometer route. The bands are now asked to, uh, asked to act upon this philosophy that is the guiding principle of Carnival Calabar that, has, that is here to stay. From the millennium year 2000, we identified this unique area of our competitive advantage, which is the Calabar Festival, the Christmas Festival. From that young administration, from that young team, from that young group, to change the landscape for Nigeria, to change the story for cross variants and for cross river state. That is where we are. And the bands will come up this time around to try to interpret the team using dance, using music, using color, using costume, using makeup, and above all, using the beats, the jigidas, and that warmth that is unique to only cross river state. That warmth that is African and that cultural renaissance we want to create through this great platform that has made all humanity one. We received the indications from our dear South African neighbors, from Kenya, from Ethiopia. Luckily for us this year, the Ethiopian airline, easily the strongest in all of Africa, is trying to partner with us. Uh, we've received overtures, I mean, a year from Ghana. We've received years from Thailand, from China from Mexico, from Brazil, um, a Caribbean assembly from the USA. About 22 countries are, are lining up to be part of the International Carnival Calabar after being on the road with us on the 28th of March. We're also having a team out of Dakar Carnival, the Dakar Senegal. It's an acrobatic group of young, energetic boys and girls who are coming to create adrenaline to pump in the hearts of the people. These are some of the things His Excellency is beginning to do too. He has introduced the, the, the bikers, carnival as we are aware. He introduced the Formula K, which are speed cars that will run the city streets of Calabar. He's also introducing um, unique events that we would like to have them as surprises to our team investors who will be coming to Calabar. The socioeconomic impact on the economy of Cross State and Nigeria is huge, is uncountable because the employment uh, ratio kicks up, the hotels are fully booked, everybody is busy and of course there is an unofficial truth between the good people and the bad people. What am I saying? The crime rate, Pumel, and that is what any responsible government would like to do. How do you engage your active population? How do you engage your active group of young men and women by engaging them, by changing their lives, by turning their lives, by ensuring that they can put food on their table. This is what is um, um, happening in Crossover State today. From July, August, when the headlights begin, when the mass camps come to life, they begin to make costumes, they begin to make beats, they begin to rehearse, you know, and then we take on the carnival uh, route itself to, to, to ensure that it is in order. His Excellency has also introduced through the overtures of the Federal Ministry of Trade and Investment the Buy Niger uh, segment, which is the commercial angle. The Buy Niger segment is that that has offered the Buy Made in Nigeria goods and services to promote that Nigerians we can do it for ourselves. If you come to the free trade zone itself in Calabar, over 52 companies have set up already manufacturing or are about to become manufacturing. Today we hear of uh, Afri phone, uh, made in Nigeria telephone that is. Android and 3G and 4G, we believe that with this Buy Niger opportunity, Nigerians will have the opportunity also to begin to patronize their homemade goods and we'll take it from there. You agree with me that it is only in Crossover State that we have Homeland Security gazetted and a bill passed by the House of Assembly. Today, at every 10 uh, 10 minutes drive, you have patrol vehicles or stations with a full complement of the armed forces and the police manning the city streets, you know, uh, throughout the course of the year. We believe this is one of those, you know. We, we believe that we should not have obvious 
um, security on the carnival route. But on the peripheral um, uh, positioning, our security forces have been completely energized and we have a complete buy-in from the leadership. And I believe life and properties are secured. And this is what we offer to the world. Cross River State is a place anyone who loves peace would like to be. And that is why we say come and leave and be at rest.